Hello, everybody. I'm Dr. Margaret McIntyre Latta, professor and director of the Okanagan School of Education. I'm thrilled that the English Foundation program is housed within the school, and it's our intent that the program provides a rich and supportive community for your studies with us. Totally confident that the leadership of Dr. Scott Douglas alongside instructors within the program are collectively invested in providing optimal learning conditions for each of you. Don't hesitate to reach out and contact me at any time. A sincere welcome. Hello everyone, my name is Scott Douglas and I'm an associate professor in the Okanagan School of Education here in Kelowna, British Columbia. I'm also the Director of English as an Additional Language Programs in the Okanagan School of Education. I just wanted to welcome everybody to the English Foundation Program. I'm very excited about the semester coming up and I think you're going to have a great time and you're going to learn a lot of English that's going to set you on the right path to doing well in your undergraduate studies. Myself, I've been a teacher for over 20 years. I've taught in places such as the Middle East, Japan, Alberta, British Columbia, and I'm excited to still be teaching and uh, working with folks such as yourself. So I will see you all soon. Take care. Hello, welcome to EAP 103. I am going to be your listening and speaking teacher. My name is Amber McLeod, and I've been teaching for about 15 years now. I have my master's in education and a bachelor of science degree. Some fun facts about me. My favorite foods are lasagna and dessert, and I love big dogs. In our course of listening and speaking, we will be focusing on note-taking skills and listening to podcasts as well as videos. We will also be working on our speaking skills through discussions and presentations. Myself and my TAs will be available to help you whenever you have questions or need help with an assignment or if you just want to talk. We're available by Zoom, by email. We will have virtual office hours, so don't worry. We look forward to meeting all of you very soon. Bye for now. Hi, my name is Karen Weeb, and I'm a teaching assistant with the English Foundation Program at the Okanagan School of Education. I'm also a first year grad student. I like motorcycles. I like music and I play a six string guitar and I love going out for coffee. So I look forward to meeting you in September when class starts and getting to know about you as well. Hi everyone, I'm Mike. I'm the graduate teaching assistant for EAP 103 academic reading and writing. As you can see, I'm out here enjoying my morning exercise. I really love being here in the Okanagan. It gives me a great opportunity to enjoy the outdoors, spend some time at the beach in the summer, uh, do some fishing in the fall, and spend some time skiing in the winter as well. So hopefully you'll have that chance to, uh, to enjoy all of those things once you arrive here as well. And uh, for now though, let's talk a little bit about what you'll experience in EAP 103 Academic Reading and Writing. As the title suggests, the main purpose is to help you develop your reading and writing skills you need to be successful at university and each week we'll be working with some different themes and we'll be building from those themes and looking at how we can learn vocabulary and different features of language that might help you talk about those themes in a more effective way hello everybody my name is Anita Veal and I'll be instructor for EAP 104 section 001. Specifically, I'll be teaching the reading and writing component of the course. A little bit of myself, I have been teaching for the past 10 years and I traveled a lot, studied abroad as well, so I'm not sure to be international students. And with my travel and with my studying abroad, I have met wonderful people and I can't wait to meet you as well. I also live in Kelowna with my beautiful family, three children and my husband. So about the course, all the information that you need to know in terms of the course outline, the reading materials, the deadlines and the assignments, um, everything else can be found on Canvas. So once you have access to Canvas, please take a look at it. And if you 
have any questions, which I'm sure you will, please feel free to email me. I can't wait to see you all on September 8th, um, the first week of September, of course. Um, so I look forward to meeting everybody soon. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye. Hello, everyone. Welcome to UVCO. My name is Prapti, and I'm your TA for EAP 103 this fall. I'm studying philosophy, politics, and economics, and I'm going into my fourth year at UBC. This is roughly my third time TAing, and I'm so excited to meet each and every one of you. Let me share a few things about myself. I absolutely love playing badminton. And two would be, I just started to learn how to ski, and I'm, I'm getting it. So if any of you ever want to go skiing when things are not so virtual, let me know, and I'd love to hit the slopes with you. Third thing would be, I have a major sweet tooth. If you ever want dessert recommendations in Kelowna, I will be the person to pick up you. Um, I'm really looking forward to welcoming all of you to the course. Um, as your TA, I will be facilitating the labs, which would have a lot of fun activities and assignments, and we'll have a good balance of learning and having fun. We'd be working on grammar, presentations, writing skills, listening skills, and we'll have a lot of fun things to do. If you ever need to reach out as with general questions regarding Kelowna, the Okanagan, academics, please feel free to do so. I am here for you and I'm excited to see all of you. Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. What's up, everybody? My name is Ronan and I'm coming to you from the traditional territory of the Okanagan Nation. I'm living in Kelowna, British Columbia, and I am one of the fantastic graduate teaching assistants for the EAP 103 program. So, what does a GTA do, a graduate teaching assistant? Well, it's going to be my job to help out in the live synchronous sessions. On top of that, I'll also be running and teaching in some of the labs, and of course, I will have office hours to help you with essays, assignments, presentations, homework, or anything along those lines. I'm here to help you in your language learning journey. I am currently in my second year of my master's program in UBCO, and I am focusing on materials development and language learning. So, a bit about me. I am originally from Ireland. I moved to Canada about five years ago. When I'm not teaching English, you can find me hiking, you can find me camping, you can find me in the mountains or swimming across a lake somewhere in British Columbia. I absolutely love ice cream. My favorite type of ice cream will be peanut butter and chocolate ice cream. When you get to Kelowna, you gotta check it out because it's delicious. Anyways. We'll be getting together for about two hours per week over the next couple of months, and I can't wait to get to know you all. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to reach out. All my contact information is on Canvas. Anyways, that's it for now. I hope you have a great day, and we will talk soon. Bye. Hi, my name is Holly Bell, and I'll be your instructor for the EAP 104 course. I'll be focusing on the listening and speaking part of your course. I'm originally from California in the United States, but I met a cute Canadian one summer when I was working in Austria, and we've been married 30 years now. I've been teaching various ages and stages in different countries. I taught in Japan for 12 years, and my three children were born there. Then we went to Nairobi, Kenya for one and a half years. And now we've been here in Canada for 10. What are my hobbies, you might ask? I love to travel. I've been to Russia, Dubai, many countries in Europe, along with Ecuador, Panama, Costa Rica, and the Dominican Republic. I love meeting people from other countries and hearing about their culture, learning about different customs and foods, especially the foods. And I hope you teach me about your favorite foods. So what will you be learning in this class? Well, in our listening and speaking classes, we will be focusing on helping you to increase your English skills by incorporating various activities for you to develop your ability to feel confident in speaking. 